Uh, we're just working through the processes right now, making sure that we're going to dot our I's, cross our T's at the moment. Uh, disappointed in the process. Um, obviously, the timing, um, obviously with the uh, call that the refs made is an unsportsmanlike, then to be taken through by the integrity unit at this level at such a crucial time. Uh, disappointed with it, but uh, as you said, uh, we're working through it. There's a bit of a precedence there, I guess. We saw Gary Brown punch someone earlier in the season and didn't get suspended for a game. So yeah. do you think you've got a, a good case to appeal it? I think we got a lot of cases that we can't put against that. But at the end of the day, they'll take the merits of what it is right now. Uh, we'll have to look at the uh, decision then. Um, in terms of, are you disappointed that it's been going after the game by obviously an outside party? Is that disappointing that it's been done that way? I think it's just disappointing in the context of where we are. You know, it's a semi-final game. Uh, intensity goes up a notch and uh, physicality does the same thing and for us to get that lodged look they have their right to do that but just the timing obviously for us coming into the second game needing to win is always hard. If you do will, will there be a chance to get it done before tomorrow night? If you... Yeah we're working hard at that through the process just to uh, try and make the decision. Seeing how powerful Mark is going to be Jack Look next man up is our mentality that's always been the case we're always stronger as a team rather than as a, a personal unit. Um, look, we've got a lot of guys that have been training all throughout the year. Yeah, we're going to miss his height and what he brings, but we also have the confidence to be able to come out and work together as a team. Will you be seeking, when this is all done, seeking clarity from the league about this whole process? 100%, yeah. Clarity is what we all want, parity, and just a, a transparency in terms of the decisions made into it. Hey. Oh, nice no, one, no. Just, just one on Mags saying, obviously, a uh, massive boost for the club to keep here for a couple of years. Unbelievable. You know, this is a huge signing for the club. Uh, Mags has uh, made, made his intentions, uh, I guess, pretty clear to us that he wanted to stay in Tasmania. Tasmania is a great place for him. Um, and I think the people of Tasmania are lucky to have a talent like Will because I don't think he'll be around too long with the projection of how he's playing for us. And as a, as a club, as a family, uh, we're really stoked to have him. Number one, ultimate priority. <laughs> uh, with Will and look, everybody sees what he does on game day. You know, the, he takes us up another level. I think if you go through the stats, when Will's off the court, what it does to us. So for us, it was priority number one going into the season that he wasn't going to come out of it uh, without an extension.